So today we pretty much, we got a bunch of grade fours came into the class. They were here last year about this kind of time. And now they're coming back to check out their plants and see how much they've grown and see how many plants yeah. they planted. And how much? Yep. Old cut block? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, old yeah. cut yeah. block. Old logging yeah. cut block. Yep. Hey everyone, I'm Pippa. <laughs> and I'm Allie. I'm Scarlett. I'm Tilly. And we're at the best place ever. Although there was a fire here a long, long time ago, last year. The area the kids are working on was a cut block and they are working to bring it back to what it was originally. Yeah, so this is this one looks a bit more healthy. This might have got a little bit nipped, but we can see some nice green growth coming out the top. So that's going to oh. hopefully be a nice healthy tree in a couple of years. We'd love to see uh, like 90, 95% uh, tree survival and continue on for 15 years until it can be can declared free growing. <laughs> What's good about this? Getting kids outside. There's nothing better than having kids learning on the land, learning in an authentic manner. They're measuring, they're counting, they're doing averages, they're calculating mean, they're seeing the success of the planting from last year. They're learning about forest regeneration. So much better to do it outside than to do it from a Google slide presentation. And what do you think about uh, what's going on up here? Uh, I think it's pretty cool that uh, we have an opportunity within school to uh, learn about how our uh, forests grow and how um, logging is actually important for the forest and how we actually help the forest and what a lot of people think hurts the forest. And just seeing the like the growth of everything, all these healthy plants like flowers that you wouldn't usually see, it's, it's really cool coming up here and just seeing how the earth uh, replenishes itself. Not a bad way to kind of spend a day at school either. Yeah, it's a lot better than like algebra or something. The best way to know that this was a success is to hear students from last year talk about how much they were looking forward to coming back this year so they could revisit the forest where they planted their trees. Rob Gibson, Castanet News, West Kelowna.